hello today's March 14 and like I said on the other video I just got back I was gone almost a week wasn't planned but anyway I haven't done my tomatoes as yet so today I'm going to do my tomatoes for sure I'm gonna clean this out real quick before I do anything but the point of this is that I'm going to do tomatoes in this and also my other ones in these the long guy and the short guy I can squeeze them in between oh here you go that's better I can squeeze them in different areas so these are two sets I'm gonna to do today with tomatoes the thing is that I have soil already prepared but this is over a week old so what I'm gonna do I'm boiling some water right now I'm gonna put some more hot water on here because that's a mistake I made I realized before I left I had some more soil in here and I used it up before I left and redo this and what I did with this soil was I put some more in my potatoes here and I healed the potatoes that was in this container in this bag remember the potatoes from this bag they grew tall I healed it up with the soil from this which was a mistake I should put some more hot water on it first make sure there's nothing in there I came back I have gnats not a lot I just put these out too not a lot of gnats but I have gnats gnats fungus gnats so before I make the mistake again with this water with this soil that's been here over a week I'm gonna redo it put some hot water in there and then I'm gonna put them in the square ones I'm gonna fill these with it also since I'm gonna use this one I'm gonna use a little knot I have a bunch of these box and bag so I'm gonna use these I'm gonna reconstitute them in hot water not cold I'm gonna do hot water I know I don't think like somebody said before that um, my the gnats going soil in wet soil not dry one or oh, these are all dry but they were open all over the place when I found them you know when I cleaned up the floor and clean up this area to put this over here so you know what it's still, either way they have to be reconstituted so I'm gonna do reconstitute them in hot water but I don't want to put the hot water in this because I'm scared I might mess it up I might you know melt right through it so what I'm gonna do is I have a ton of these things I mean I found them all over the place and more of the other one I know some were given to me I just put them down you know when I started my garden so anyway I'm gonna put the these in there I think it's two, four, six, eight, ten. Each of these take ten. So I'm going to put ten of these in here and reconstitute them in this container, metal pan. Oops. Yeah, I'm going to reconstitute them in here. And hopefully, I can take them out with them falling apart, without them falling apart. Four, six, eight. Look at that. I did nine, so I need one more. Oops, I need one more. So I'm going to reconstitute them in here. Two, four, six, eight, nine. I need one more, ten. At least I'm going to find out if it works, if I can. Because I've, I've used these before in the past, I'm sure. Just don't remember. And I think they'll stay together. They don't fall apart. They stay together. I think you can see. Like one part is smooth. One part is like that. I think this part should be up. So I'm going to do all of those smooth and rough. Put the, all these up. Put the hot water on them. Let them constitute, reconstitute, and then plant my tomatoes once I transfer them. So let me get the water going, and I will be back later. I can switch. I don't have to do this on tape, because that's running, running up my time. There you go. I have two, four, six, eight, ten. I'm going to get a reconstitute and that. All right, I'll be back. <laughs> 